Hi, welcome back to my channel Beauty Tips by Sud. In today's video, we're going to do something different and this video is about a review video. I got these many products in the month of July, so we will talk about these products one by one. So if you are interested, keep on watching. Please bear my no makeup look because I was not well and I didn't feel like putting any makeup at all. So I hope you won't mind. Now let me talk about the first product which is P Blunt Volumizing Leave-In Spray. I guess the, you can see I have used these, this much of product and this is awesome. I must say this is awesome. I use it whenever I want a you know very bouncy hair and full of volume in my hair. All you have to do is just damp your hair a little bit and spray this you know in your roots and leave it. And if you blow dry it, you will see the result like humongous. I must say humongous is the word. But if you even leave it just like that and let it be dry, air dry by itself then also it gives such a nice volume to your hair that it look perfect so yeah this is one of my favorite product which i got in the starting itself of july and i really 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 like it so if you have used this product let me know in the comment section that how did you find it and uh, let's share what kind of product you like in the b-blood category i have also used their uh, you know the dye and uh, you know color which is also good so yeah this is the first product i was talking about the product is this maybelline fit me coreless foundation and i am in the shade of 310 this foundation is my uh, you know far most the favorite foundation i got it not just blend very easily but it give you that mattified look which oily skin people want they don't want you know a oily and a creamy kind of creams so this is perfect for those and I really love this product this day I got this I am using it every time <laughs> whenever I go for you know have to do makeup I'm using this every time so this is a, another great purchase for my in the month of July now another uh, the third of would be product would be this thing Ooh, I, you have seen me using this in the contouring and highlighting I would say this is great but it's blend easily it give you that nice uh, you know contoured and uh, highlighted look but the only drawback is it's a cream based product and uh, you have to make sure that when you know, apply this you have to set this with a uh, bronzer or uh, you know with a setting powder so that it doesn't melt into your skin because it's oil based so yeah people who have oily skin they you know find little problematic my skin is kind of mixed it's dry from my cheeks and oily in t-zone so I don't face I feel such problem with this I just have to put it down and you know set it across so I'll give it's okay product. I won't say it's um, you know highly recommended for oily skin, but if you got a dry skin, you can definitely go ahead for this product. This is again a nice product which I got. Now the next is this mascara, and it's Maybelline Lash Sensational Full Fan Effect. This is a revolution when you talk about amazing eyelashes. You don't need fake eyelashes if you got this kind of, uh, you know, the consistency of this uh, mascara is amazing. Even the brush is great. Can you see how uh, small bristles are there? And this gives you that fan effect and long and elongated mascara look, which is perfect. You don't need to put the fake eyelashes and still you can have this full volume long uh, eyelashes so yeah if you want but yeah uh, one drawback I would say removing this is a task it's waterproof so yeah oh you don't you know you have to rub it you know you have to make sure that you have a good uh, makeup remover and uh, what all I can say uh, 
if you don't have a makeup remover then make sure that you know you take a good amount of coconut oil and then put it across your eyes blend it slowly so that every makeup melts out so yeah it takes time when you you know try to remove it otherwise it's great product again so when we talk about when I bought this product, I realized okay, coconut oil is not working for me. Uh, otherwise, I always prefer coconut oil as a makeup remover. But after getting this product, I thought it's a good time to invest in a makeup remover. So I got this Maybelline again, and it's a total clean, clean express eye and lip makeup remover. This is good. You just have to shake it uh, so that the oil and the water mixes. This is. That's why we use uh, coconut oil. Uh, just mix it, put it in your cotton, put it across in your eye, keep it there for 10 seconds and just swipe it up. So it removes all the eye makeup very easily. So yeah, it's a good, it's a good thing when you have such products in your kitty and uh, you want to remove it effectively, get these kind of uh, makeup removers. Next product. Okay, the next thing is I was always, you know, planning to buy a primer and I got the Lakme primer because we Indians, we mostly invest, you know, in Lakme products because of its longevity. <laughs> but yeah, I like this product. It got a very, um, I would say it is it very, you know, it's a clear kind of uh, primer, but it got a very pinkish shade, which is nice and it gives you that no very nice mattified look if you sh if I show you some it's like the color is like this and if I put on my hand it blends very easily it's very smooth and it gives you a very nice you know a pearly touch it's make your skin smooth so that it helps your makeup to glide and at times if you just put uh, even a primer it's good to go it's actually good to go because the because of this little bit of pinkish tint in it it makes your skin look okay half done <laughs> so if you don't want a heavy makeup look you can definitely just apply this primer then me do your rest of the makeup just liner or lipstick and you can good to go for it with this only so yeah it's a good primer I must say and uh, it's very price effective uh, usually products available in the market uh, primer starts with 800 bucks to 780 and I got this product for rupees mentioned it's 650 I got this for around 575 or something in Nika so yeah I would say you can go ahead and check how much they are actually charging now but I got this for 575 let me I'll, I'll find out and I'll uh, link everything below in the description box but yeah this is again a good purchase next thing is oh 95 now this lip cream is just awesome these days I'm completely into nude lip colors and lip shades because not just give you that Kylie Jenner kind of look but it gives you a very natural look as well uh, this color is coffee light and this shade is awesome I mean in, I'm in love with this shade first of all look at the you know the brush of this Lakme product you can see it's a very teardrop kind of thing which helps you to apply this you know very evenly across your lips you know uh, reaching the corners of your lips so yeah this is a very nice uh, thing and if I show you the shade it's like this it's a very nice seriously it's a Kylie Jenner shade if you really want a dupe of Kylie Jenner's those uh, uh, lip shades and which she wears like brown and nudes this is perfect it got a very light tint of a, you know a purple tone to it which you know suits Indian skin and it makes you look very good so yeah you can go for it you can see the shade it's very nice so this is again this is my favorite purchase in lipstick now lip cream for to be specific again now the next one is again lipstick which is again my favorite 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 purchase it's of Nika and I like Nika lipsticks these are good they actually deliver you very great lips colors and this is mischievous plum and this is a lovely lovely plum shade oh 
I'll show you its shade now. How beautiful it is! This is perfect for night time. I must say, this is perfect. This is actually a winter shade, but if you apply it in, you know, uh, with your pink sari or maybe with the very beautiful uh, black sari, this shade will look awesome. I mean, look at the color, the intensity of wow. I mean, I was in love with this shade when I got this. I mean, like, I want this shade for sure. And I got this. And this was for how much? $3.99 if I'm not wrong. Anyways, I'll find out and like make it down. So again, this is again a good purchase. And the next would be... T3 essential oil. I love essential oil and I keep mixing essential oil with my carrier oils and try to make a different uh, face oil with this. T3 is, you know, if you have an oily skin and if you got uh, pimple prone skin, I recommend that invest in a pure essential oils. Right now, even Nika have introduced their essential oil range. After finishing this, I will I will definitely go ahead and buy that. And uh, with the tea three essential oil, it's it's made, it's very uh, the properties are antiseptic, and it makes sure that bacteria doesn't spread on your face. So if you got a pimple or a zit on your face, just take a you know a earbud, dip it in it, and just put directly over the pimple, just on the tip, not on the entire face because. These are very concentrated, just a little bit on it, it and leave it for night. You will see that you know the bump or the pimple will reduce very effectively. So this is a very good investment if you got an acne prone skin and with the acne prone skin you believe me or not I got you know even I got a pimple, I got the acne prone skin I face the adult acne which is more and less related to your hormones which we call cystic acne and for that my doctor recommend me this thing it's a Sibla company's sasalic sasalic as I would say uh, foaming face wash uh, if I talk about face wash you know for acne prone skin we always recommend products which got salicylic acid this is a salicylic complete salicylic acid with 1% in it so this is a pure salicylic acid it's a medicine it's not a beauty product it's a medicine but it reduces your pimple effectively I only use this product when I have cystic acne and I'm not able to you know cure them with any other products beauty products then I use this twice a day one in the morning one before I go to sleep and what you have to do is it's a very liquidy kind of thing but if you shake it it gives you that foam effect so just two pumps uh, you just have to take two pumps of this uh, salicylic acid apply on your pimple prone areas like your face and you know just with very mild circular motion and keep it there for 20 to 30 seconds and wash it off this thing makes your skin very dry so you have to use it under your, uh, you know, when, when you have, you just have to talk to your doctor before using it. Okay, the next product is this LA Girl Gel Liner. This is not a black color liner, but a very nice dark brown shade of liner. Can you see this? Yeah. This is perfect for everyday look. It won't give you that harsh uh, liner look, but very natural. And it blends like butter, but it doesn't make in the beginning once it's dry it's set but you, if you blend it very nicely it will give you that nice brown smoky effect so it's perfect for those brown smoky look so i really like this gel liner and it's very nice it's actually nice so i would recommend if you're looking for a nice brown liner for in your uh, you know in your makeup box you can go for it so it's la girl again and it's a nice gel liner they also give you this brush which I didn't like it's very flat it's better to use your own uh, eye, eyeliner gel, gel, gel liner it's uh, 
brushes which are fine but if you just want to put it across a thick one then you can use it it's very thick and very blunt so yeah i don't like it anyways uh the second last product is these face masks oh this is perfect for your night time and uh, what you have to do is wash your face tone your face with any toner or or even a glove gel i generally put this thing in my freezer for a few minutes once it's cool i'll take out the you know face mask and put it across my face keep it there for 15 to 20 minutes and remove it pat dry all the uh, liquid thing it got it's very moisturizing and i just go to sleep i just i always apply face mask when in my uh, you know night time routine i later i don't apply any moisturizer anything just this it will make your skin moisturized you know it makes your skin so hydrated when you wake up in the morning you will see that glowing effect i was in love this is from real natures and i got this from nyka again in fact i uh, you know this this cost you around 100 250 and uh, i like this but it's very easy you know a uh, face mask for one time use if you are spending 100 bucks at times you feel yeah you can make it at home so even i had tried to make this at home a uh, face mask at home so if you want me to share that please comment that below i will share the diy of face mask which is very cost So this is the second last in this I got rice which I like the most. Okay, then lily. Oh, it's very the scent is so good. It's very relaxing. The third one is goji berry. It's again a very hydrating mask. And next one is longan. I don't know what it is. Longan. This is again a hydrating mask. So it's it's a, I would say a replacement of your moisturizer at night for me it helps as a relaxer it relaxes your skin it makes your skin you know breathe properly so this thing is a good thing to go for last thing is for all the married ladies and <laughs> it is sindhu okay so uh i got this from lotus earlier i had from shahnaz husain which is again very 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 nice color i always like the pure red sindoor color and this is this actually justify that pure red sindoor color and the shade is divine dew love drop okay the shade is very beautiful is actually a pure red color if i show you and it looks good you know i Generally, I prefer the natural sindoor, and uh, I always go for the liquid sindoor when I'm going out, and I don't want to spread on my uh, head or something. So I just put a dot and then go for it. So these are the haul and the review. Uh, I'm done with all my products. I actually got more products, but I'm, you know, the, those were the products which I'm not satisfied with. these many products i was satisfied buying so i hope you like this video and if you did give this video a thumbs up do share your experiences what you find if you have used any of these products let me know how did you like those and uh, i'll see you next time till then remember beauty lies within